In today's wrap-up, the deadliest clashes for 18 months take place between Armenian and Azerbaijani forces. The state of emergency has been extended for another month. Budget airline Wizz Air has announced another flight route between Abu Dhabi and Yerevan. And a concept design proposal has been released to regenerate Yerevan's old Khon district. The deadliest clash for 18 months has taken place between Armenian and Azerbaijani forces. According to the Armenian Defense Ministry, Azerbaijani forces attacked an Armenian border post along the state border in the northern region of Tavush. According to the spokeswoman of the Armenian Defense Ministry, Shushan Stepanyan, the Armenian side did not suffer any casualties, but two police officers suffered minor injuries. Azerbaijan reported four casualties and five injuries. The Russian foreign minister held separate phone talks with both the Armenian and Azerbaijani foreign ministers after the skirmish. Both foreign ministers also held talks with the OSCE Minsk Group co-chairs, a body working to achieve a peaceful settlement of the Nagorno-Karabakh conflict. The Armenian Foreign Ministry also stated that Azerbaijan's actions are against the OSCE Minsk Group co-chairs' call to refrain from provocative actions. A special session of the Russian-led Collective Security Treaty Organization was scheduled for today, but has been postponed. The announcement of the special session was also removed from the CSTO's website. Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan said at today's special government session that provocative actions will not go unanswered. The Armenian government has extended the emergency state for one more month, lasting until August 12th. This is the fourth time the state of emergency has been extended. It was first declared on March 16th due to the pandemic. On Sunday 12th, 577 new cases of COVID-19 were confirmed, as well as 214 recoveries and six more deaths. On Monday 13th, 182 more cases were confirmed, raising the total number of cases to 32,151. 232 more recoveries were also reported and eight more deaths, raising the death toll to 573. Hungarian budget airline Wizz Air has announced a new flight route from Abu Dhabi to Yerevan, which will begin operating from October 3, 2020. This comes as budget airlines like Wizz Air and Ryanair began a string of new flights to Armenia in 2020. Wizz Air had already launched three new flight routes to Yerevan from Larnaca, Vienna and Vilnius. Concept designs have been released of a proposed regeneration of Yerevan's old Kond district. Kond is one of the oldest districts of the Armenian capital and is located in the central district of Yerevan. The concept design videos released show revamped streets and buildings, with the aim being to attract tourists and make it an ideal spot to open businesses. Sivunets Arsha Luis Mghdesian spoke to Armenia's Minister of High-Tech Industries, Hagob Arsha Kyan. They spoke about the development of the high-tech industry in Armenia, which is one of the most rapidly growing sectors of the economy. Arsha Kyan's ministry is also in charge of military-related research and development. He stated that Armenia could potentially become an arms-exporting country and added that there are many potential markets that Armenia could tap into.